thank you for tuning back into my channel this is hair chick and today is relaxer day as promised i'm coming with an updated relaxer routine um, one of my viewers requested me to do this so i'm going to do this today the only thing different that i do now that i didn't do in the past was now i use the lie relaxer i'm sorry no lie i have not used one of these in years um Last time I went to my beauty, so my beauty supply store, I could not find the Elasta QP with lye. So I got the no lye kit, and it was okay. Um, but I made the mistake and got super by mistake, and did not realize that. So today I made sure I got regular. Right now I'm just unboxing everything for you. Um, I do not use the oil moisturizer that they give you to use afterwards. I'll tell you all what I use. Um, in a minute but anyway of course you all you all know they provide you with the relaxer the activator that you stir it up with the neutralizing shampoo and conditioner so I do use all of that that comes with the kit um, I use my own gloves I don't like the plastic gloves so I get some of these from my beauty supply and I use a relaxer brush now or applicator brush now the same routine as far as the base petroleum jelly I'm going to relax my hair and then I'm going I'm going to use my setting lotion this is going to be the only thing that I put in my hair after the relaxer is Lotta Body I went back to my Lotta Body I didn't like the other set lotion that I had and I just put it in a spray bottle spray it all over my hair once that's done I proceed with my blow dry and flat iron so right now I'm going to take this scarf off for you I'm just leave to show you what I'm working with I am this is a five month stretch so I am going to insert some clips of me doing the, doing the actual relaxer and then I'm going to show you immediate relaxer results and then I may go ahead and insert a clip of it when it's fully blow dried and flat ironed for you so you can see how it looks. I was trying to take my bun down but anyway next time you see me I will be inserting a clip of me doing the actual relaxer and then I want to show you immediate relaxer results. So I'm going to pop back in right here and show you the actual relaxer application um, that I'm doing. Now, just a few tips here. I based my scalp really, really good today because I was coming from a protective style. Um, and my psoriasis has been acting up really bad. My hair, is, my scalp has been itchy this week. So I did a really good base with the Vaseline. Really, I want you to know that I'm concentrating only on the new growth. I have a clear mark, a line of demarcation where my new growth is. I can clearly see it. So as you can see, I have applied the relaxer to that section. Then I go back and I do my front edge last, like so. After this, I'm going to work it all in one more fast time. You should be timing yourself. This should take no more than between 15 and 20 minutes, the actual application, okay? okay? Once I get one section done, I go ahead and swoop it up like that. Then I'm gonna start back going through um, larger sections to apply the relaxer. That's gonna be my second work through, and then I'll come back to show you my results. As, as promised, here we are, immediate relaxer results. I did not cheat. I did not take the towel off before. I'm showing you. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, it feels so good. Um, remember what it looked like before? That was the five month stretch. I could feel the difference immediately when I started rinsing the relaxer out. I love it. Guys, I need to bend down. My tripod isn't high enough. Sorry about that. Anyway, I am back as promised with the flat iron and blow dry results of my relaxer. I love it. It has lots of body. I think I will take just a small amount of my oil just for the ends. My hot oil sets before I wrap it. Um, because besides the lot of body and my scalp oil, that's the only thing on my hair as far as you know a leave-in. So yeah, I'm gonna put some oil, put some oil on it. I'm gonna wrap it. Sorry, I'm not in this frame. It's late. This whole process took about two and a half hours, minus the time I took to eat. So um, I hope you all enjoyed this. Thank you so much for watching. And if you 
as always, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask and any suggestions on anything you would like to see. Thank you so much. Good night.